She's arguably Iceland's most famous export. Now Bjork has turned from singer to environmental campaigner. Her new single Natura highlighting the threat of expanding heavy industry to the beauty of her native country. Plans are in the pipeline for three giant aluminium smelters on the island. Three are already in operation there like this one near Reykjavik. They use huge amounts of power. Power that many believe would have to be supplied by a damaging network of new geothermal and hydroelectric power stations across Iceland. I think I'm just one of many people who have stood up and spoken out, and, and, but I have to do it. I will not be able to live with my own conscience when my grandchildren um, drive around Iceland and it's just full of, you know, like factories and smelters. Björk's Natura campaign aims to identify and promote new, environmentally friendly and sustainable businesses for the country in the wake of its recent economic collapse. I feel that now we need to be a little more humble. We cannot be so arrogant uh, and just run around and take, 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 you know, take other people's monies and, and take loans and just take nature without thinking about the consequences. We need to be sustainable, not only environmentally and, and, and economically, but also morally. As well as the song, Bjork has made a documentary highlighting the issues for her campaign website. The single featuring Radiohead's Tom York is released on October the 27th, with all proceeds going towards the Natura campaign. Bjork's hope that it helps launch a new start for Iceland.